So you might be trying to figure out how to connect your Galaxy Watch with your specific Samsung Galaxy 23 in this example. Now doing this is actually very basic. I have my Galaxy Watch 3 here, which hopefully is compatible with my Samsung Galaxy phone. So to start off, what you're going to want to do is you want to go and make your way over to your Galaxy phone and you want to make your way over to the wearable application. So find Samsung wearable, you can search for it, but this is basically the application right here. And what you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and basically allow everything that comes up at the bottom. So it's going to allow like people around you or like location services, whatnot. Just go ahead and allow everything around you. And at this point, make sure your Galaxy Watch is turned on and make sure it's in a panel that looks kind of something like this. Now, when you're ready, you can go ahead and, you know, click scan and it should automatically discover this specific Galaxy Watch. And for a lot of people, that's probably all you're going to have to do. So in this case, I'll just go and click scan again and it already sees this watch for me. So all I have to do is go and click here and it's going to ask me to verify this number with this number. And as you can see, all you're going to want to do here is go and click tap to continue. And it's to check your phone to complete setup. I can go and click confirm right here. And then it's going to start setting up my watch for me. So it's going to download software. It's going to go ahead and just install everything that it needs to install on my Galaxy watch. And it, that is pretty much all you're going to have to do. It really is that basic. Now, a few things I want to note, make sure your Galaxy watch and your you know Galaxy phone are next to each other, you know, for the duration of this specific setup, depending on the Galaxy Watch that you have, you may need to have it connected to your phone in order to actually get calls and you know messages and all that stuff. Unless you have like an LTE cell plan with that watch, then it should be able to work separately. But that's another thing. Another thing on top of that, make sure if you don't already have a Galaxy Watch, make sure that the watch that you're buying is compatible with your phone and vice versa. If you're buying a very old Samsung Galaxy or a very old Galaxy Watch, it may not be compatible with your specific phone. So if you're okay with those things, then you should be okay for the most part. So at this point, it's just going to go ahead and set up your specific device. I'd recommend just keeping it on this specific device. Don't restart it or anything. And sooner than later, your watch should be ready to go. And you can start using your watch with your Galaxy phone. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. The like button helped me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.